Hi everyone, Sat here. So we just hit a thousand subscribers. I'm really pleased about that. So I wanted to do two things in this video. The first thing is a giveaway where you can get, well, there's 10 coupons available uh, where you can get the AR Foundation course that I made, the placement course that's on Udemy for absolutely free. So the first 10 people who click on that link will get access to that uh, that course if you haven't already got that anyway then um, there you go you can have that if you missed this don't worry there's another link below where you can get a huge discount and get it for 10.99 um, so why do you want to get that course why would anyone want to get the course well that goes on to the second um, thing that I want to talk about and that's in, in this video which is a showcase to show some of the amazing apps that people have made after going through that course so first of all, we've got this really cute Christmas AR app. I really like this one as well. Uh, Peter, it's by Peter and he took things a little bit further um, than the AR course. He you know, added in some particle effects, uh, a nice little border as well. Um, so this is, a really, this is a really smart idea uh, because it's Christmas. It's a Christmas AR app. So every year people are going to want to download this. So I really like the idea of creating seasonal apps um that happened to ar this is what a lot of companies do as well so to see someone do this uh, using the ar app uh, ar course was amazing actually i think he's done a great job and you can pick this up and download this off of the google play store right now as well i've got it on my phone so check that out uh, as well i've got a link i'll leave a link below and there should be a link at the end of this video next app is such an interesting idea it's a co-visioning app a uh, community app uh, built by uh, jesse and it uses augmented reality to allow a community to kind of plan their area and envision what they would like in regards to um just like a, a, a better area you know a, a better a, a better area to live in you know increase things like trees and plants uh, and what that would look like if all the community came together. So sharing that experience as well, uh, allowing people to place that stuff down. That was done for her, her thesis as well. Uh, and I just think this is, again, this is something I never really envisioned anyone using the, the course for. So I was just um, was really shocked to see it because I just think it's a brilliant idea. Um, and it just goes to show, show how versatile AR, AR can be. It doesn't always have to be for like a Snapchat filter or anything. It can be for something that, that can help bring communities together as well. So our next one is an AR showroom by Brett Baker. I really like this one because it's just, I, when I first saw it, I didn't realize it was an AR car. I should have I should have noticed if I was waiting for him to drop something and then uh, I noticed some of the color changing. I was like, ah, it's, it's not real. <laughs> but I like this because it goes to show, like this is like we have, uh, you know, when you're selling products, the, the way the world is going to change is going to be, it's going to be like this, right? You're not going to need to necessarily go to a showroom. You might be able to drop a car down in front of your own house and see what it would look like compared to your own one. So I really like this. This is done for as a professional uh, company so um, that he's doing this project for. So um, yeah, I love this one. I think it's really cool. Uh, so this next app is made by Mark Ruff and he received the Australian Cinematography Society Technical and Innovation Achievement Award. It's a bit of a mouthful, that. Uh, for what he did here um, and only three other people have actually got actually uh, received that so it's, it's really amazing this is like a demonstration of just pure innovation and creativity uh, and this was uh, trying to demonstrate how you could produce some incredibly high level stuff using um, something as simple as like an iPad uh, and that could that was you know technically just as useful as superior as some of the professional level equipment that's used for broadcasting i did an amazing job of, of showing showcasing this and also showing some of the limitations as well uh, and again you can see that it's it's so realistic you can you can barely tell the difference between um, the ar and what's going on in the real world so full disclosure i should also add i don't teach you how to make all of these apps these have been made by the students themselves it took a massive amount of hard work by all of them. Uh, it took them, you know, their own code, uh, their own artwork. All of that stuff was built by them. And I'm so proud of them 
for doing that. What they used from the course was just the framework. And if you want access to that framework and to some of those beginning tutorials to help you get on to on your way to do to be, possibly do something like this then you know check out the course and those links below